Step number two, incomplete assets. So what is an incomplete asset in SAP? Let's say you create an asset master record today and the field cost center is optional. So you don't put a cost center on this asset master, you leave it blank and that's okay. But then you go into configuration and you make the cost center field required, a mandatory field. Well, now this asset is considered incomplete because it's missing the cost center, even though that's a mandatory field. So you can't have that, all right? So incomplete assets are master records that for whatever reason are missing certain information. And there's a transaction, there's a report that you can run in SAP, transaction code AUVA, to find those incomplete assets. Now, I also included the technical program name right here. It's that R-A-U-N-V-A-0-0. Just because if you're still in ECC 6, not all of the transactions that I'm listing actually exist. Sometimes you have to start them using the technical program name directly. So if you run this program and it finds any incomplete assets, you must complete these assets. You must fix these assets before you can close the fiscal year. It won't let you close the year if incomplete assets exist. You simply run this program and it gives you a list like this and it just spits out the asset numbers and it gives you a, a completeness indicator, a reason why they're incomplete. And remember the example that I just gave you, right? So you create an asset master record, the field cost center is optional, so you leave it blank now you make the cost center field required. So now the asset is incomplete, but then you go back into configuration and make the cost center field optional again. All right, so really the asset shouldn't be incomplete because it's an optional field. However, in that case, the system still marks this asset as incomplete. So it's really incorrectly marked as incomplete. And if you have assets like this, you can correct them very easily simply by clicking on this little button here, or this link, correct incomplete assets. So this will fix all the assets that have been incorrectly marked as incomplete. You click on that and it'll take care of those assets. Now, if you have any other assets listed on, on this report uh, that are still on the report after you click this button, those are actually incomplete. So something is wrong with these assets and you can click on them in the report, it will tell you exactly what information is missing or why this asset is marked as incomplete.